Yo there guys, I just want to talk to you about masking off and for this Aston Martin where I did it. This is an Aston Martin DB11. So I wanted to put a bit more colour into the car, so I did with the black. And I only used matte black, so that is flat black by Tamiya. Um, I can't remember the number, sorry guys. But I did use the flat black on most of the parts. I did it on the grill the front, the back, the sides, and I do use um, Tamiya panel lines as well on the door panels and everything like that. So I hope you enjoy this video. So at this point, I'm just finished off masking it all off and cutting it out, cutting the part where I want the black part on it to be. So. I've masked it all off and then cut out the part where I wanted the black on my car. So I did the front, the grill, the the roof and the round the windows with small tape and then moved on from very thin to very fat tape. So I used all that and I used to me masking tape if you wanted to know that. And then I just, like you can see here, cut out the part I don't want. And it did take a long time. It took me about three or four hours, or even longer. So if you can take your time, it takes better. If you just need to take a break, take a break. It doesn't really matter what, at the end of the day, the And you have to love it to do it. So if you can put more time into this hobby, it's better for your models and for yourself as well. So that's what I'm just trying to say to you all. I hope you enjoy it. After a bit, we I just got the tape around the car where I'm okay with it, where it doesn't really matter because the black part weren't, I'm not gonna do anything black there. But on the back, you have to be very careful and take your time around the back. It is easy to do, but it's going, it is a bit complicated. It's where the exhaust goes and the number plates and you don't, it's up to you if you want that black. I've seen somebody do it in carbon fiber and it looks quite nice in carbon fiber too. But I just wanted to go for black, just a flat black, and that is why I did it. And um, that is the only reason why I'm just doing it this way. It's a nice, it did turn out quite nice, and I'll show you photos at the end. So please keep an eye out for them. If you can guys please share, like and comment and tell me what you think about this Aston Martin, what I've been doing. Um, the comments will be very appreciative, thank you. So now I am in the paint booth painting the black parts on the car. So with the masking tape, you can just see where the black parts need to be. So you just spray it a couple of times, hoping it doesn't go onto the paint job, because sometimes it can go onto the paint job. You can go through the masking tape, even through Tamiya tape. It's not very often you do it, but it can. So this is part where I have now seen it and I've done it, and I've now taken off all the masking tape. I was lucky enough it didn't none of it went through the tape so I'll, it turned out really so at this point I noticed the masking tape peeled away some paint and I've got a very fine tooth tooth pick or a tooth a paintbrush and I used a very fine paintbrush you can get a couple of words like a felt just look got a, a one brush on it you know what I mean it's not it's expensive but it's worth it 
and um, this one I did it and it turned out really good you can't see where I had to touch up because I did it about three or four times I even bought on before I bought the matting tape on I bought um, clear one because the last time I did this trick it failed and um, it peeled away the paint that's not with putting clear one so I did put clear one this time it still did the same job and it did do really well but it didn't take up a lot of paint it just peeled away a little on the corners and stuff like that so I do recommend you to take your time mask off where you need to mask off and then paint it not do what I did and mask off all over this is where I did the black touching up on the black part where I couldn't get to with my airbrush so I did I'm masking off and I didn't feel confident enough to cut cut away and where the knife was on it and just to make it a bit more darker and that's the only reason why I did it. I cleaned up here